I will talk briefly about a laser procedure called SLT. The letters SLT stand for Selective Laser Trabeculeplasty. This is a laser procedure that is intended to reduce the pressure in the eye. In our battle with glaucoma, glaucoma specialists have a primary job of keeping the pressure in the eye as low as possible. We can achieve this with drops, laser such as SLT and surgery. Especially in eyes that are taking several types of drops and the pressure is still too high, laser is a very reasonable and correct choice. The laser is done in the office, takes usually 5 to 10 minutes and the effect remains in the eye for as long as 5 years on average. This is what research has shown us. In that respect, laser will not last forever. On the other hand, it can give the patient in that particular eye quite a few years of additional therapy to reduce pressure. The laser procedure is very safe. There's almost no side effects or risks involved. It's not painful. I doubt if the procedure is even felt by the patient. Maybe as something touching the eye very gently, but even that I doubt most, pa most patients can feel. And more so, it's very quick and if after several years the procedure needs to be repeated, that is possible, especially so with the SLT technology. I would like to mention that there is a discussion between glaucoma experts whether the traditional approach of starting with medications should change and whether using a laser may be a good primary or first treatment option for glaucoma. This discussion is still in the air, there is no consensus, but certainly we're talking about an effective, simple and safe procedure. The issue is that not every eye can undergo the laser at any particular time. And by that, what I mean is that your eye doctor will weigh the pressure, the damage that can be seen in the visual field and or the optic nerve, the amount of drops that you are taking, and the type of glaucoma. And after weighing all that information, basically analyzing what's already in your eye chart, your doctor can reach a consensus and a decision whether laser is a relevant treatment at that particular point in time. Those patients who have learned from their eye doctor that laser is a relevant option, a relevant mode of treatment, should, in my opinion, take this suggestion very seriously and very favorably because a simple and short procedure can assist your eye doctor in balancing and challenging the risks of the disease. I wish you all the best of health and good luck.